Hi guys, Dave Wilson here again. Now, the Swiss Army knife has become synonymous with tools and useful gadgets, but did you know there's even a Swiss Army knife for watchmakers? Come with me, let me show you. So here we have the small Wenger Swiss Army knife. and This is the small pocket knife version. You can see it's made from solid anodized aluminium with a beautiful red anodized finish. It really is very attractive. It has a kind of satin finish to it. The handle is six centimeters long or about two and a half inches. And you can see it is riveted all the way through. So this is a nice solid little knife that will last for years. A um, little bit better than some of the other ones where they have the plastic sides on which ultimately break. You can see the Swiss logo there, made in Switzerland. And this contains two stainless steel blades. So the first one is a six centimetre or two and a half inch straight blade. And this is like you would find on a normal small pen knife of this size. But being a Wenger, this is extremely sharp. It's almost like a scalpel, it's a razor sharp blade. And it locks into place very solid and firmly and doesn't wobble. So this is going to be a great, useful, everyday little knife blade for a thousand and one uses. Great quality. Now if you flip it around and have a look at the other end you'll notice a small curved blade about one and a half inches or 35 millimeters and surprisingly this is not sharp at all this is quite blunt and deliberately so because this isn't designed for cutting this is designed for prising off the back of pressure fitted watch backs and so this is why it's useful for watchmakers so let's get out a watch and let's see how it works now some of them have little tabs on the back which is easy to spot others just have a small groove so these are a little bit more difficult to spot but you need to identify where the little notch or groove is now I've got a sterling silver watch here and I've got it resting on a suede pad so I don't damage it and I'm gonna hold it firmly and I'm just going to pop the edge of the blade just under the little groove there and I'm just going to rotate it, just twist the handle and that's going to pop off the cap. Now a couple little tips here, it's important to rotate it. Don't lift it up and down like you're leaving a crowbar because the tip of the blade could potentially scratch and damage the watch so you don't want to do that. Secondly, as soon as you've popped the cap open remove the blade don't use the knife to lift the whole thing up because again you could scratch the inside and you don't want the blade poking around on the inside of the watch so as soon as you've popped the cap remove the blade and take the cap off using your fingers or tweezers so there you have it a superb swiss engineered pen knife professional quality with a blade specifically designed for removing watch backs, so great quality. Incidentally, you might be wondering which is the genuine Swiss Army knife, Wenger, like we have here, or the popular Victronox? Well, I can tell you they are both licensed Swiss Army knives, and in fact, more to the point, Victronox recently bought out Wenger. So whichever you go for, you are guaranteed great Swiss quality. So there you have it. I've been Dave Wilson. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye for now.